baby, well, a honeycomb be my own. All right, class. This is a very important test. It could be the difference of you being in a college placement class or back here with me next semester. So open your blue books and begin. Stop looking at my paper. Let's answer to question five. I'm not telling. Come on, please. No, you should have studied. I did, but I didn't know that the parts of the plant were going to be on the test. I studied them anyway. Please. No, I don't cheat. Well, fine, but you got the answer to question two wrong. Did not. You did too. Where do bees live? Think about it. Combs. Bees live in combs. Haven't you heard of honeycombs? Yeah, it's a cereal. But bees live in hives. You're right. How could I have forgotten that? It's easy. Sometimes people just forget things in the middle of a test. Thanks. You're welcome. I told you, I don't cheat. But I just gave you the answer to question two. I said thanks. What more do you want? I want the answer to question five. Sorry. Can you just give me a hint? Nope. Just a little hint? No. Just a teeny little hint? <laughs> no, I'm not helping you cheat. Fine. You asked for it. Mrs. Knapp, Kathy's trying to cheat off my paper. <laughs> I am not. Yes, she is. Just look at her test. On question two, she wrote down honeycombs. She looked at my paper and saw that it was hives, so she changed her answer. Just a minute, Kathy. You cheated. Well, that's very interesting, Peter. And how could you possibly know she was cheating unless you were looking off of her paper as well? So, go to the principal's office right now. Continue class. Honeycomb, you be my baby. Honeycomb, be my baby. That's enough, Peter. 